Prince Charles reigning in all but name former minister says risky time for royal family. Prince Charles is effectively reigning on behalf of his mother as a regent in all but name, a former government minister said today. Norman Baker, a former transport minister in David Cameron's coalition administration and the ex-Liberal Democrat MP for Lewis, warned that it was a risky time for the monarchy and said goodwill towards the Queen would not necessarily transfer to Charles. In an interview with GB News, Mr. Baker, a longtime observer and critic of the royal family, likened Harry and Meghan to John Lennon and Yoko Ono. He said, Clearly the Queen is not very well and suffering I think from post-COVID symptoms, she is 95, 96 on Thursday this week. That's a very severe age. It's not surprising she can't do what she used to do but we have in fact now got a regency in all but name. The Queen is doing very little in terms of public engagements, we're talking about light duties. I understand in fact that those light duties are very light indeed, and I don't think she's been out really, apart from on one occasion, since October. He added, what's happening is effectively that we now have Prince Charles and Prince William stepping up and undertaking the Queen's duties and that's where we're at. Asked why Charles has not been officially appointed as regent. He said, it's a complicated matter making someone regent and I don't think that would be something that the Queen would personally favour. She took an oath to serve our country through thick and thin as it were. And I think she will see it is reneging on that promise, there's no need to go down that particular route. We have an arrangement where the Queen is still head of state and other members of our family are stepping up to fill the gap. And undertake works which she wouldn't have done before. When it comes to the future, eventually we'll see more of Prince Charles and Prince William and less of the Queen for the time being. Mr Baker added, we've seen a lot of damage to the royal family in recent times.